Life with restrictions hasn't slowed down the Napoli family from Balkham Hills. They've sourced supplies from their local hardware store to create a home gym. Been putting our gym gear on, getting our towel and our drink and walking out to the shed as if we're going to the gym. But not everyone benefits from exercising well and eating the right things. To understand why, the Heart Research Institute followed a group of 52 Australian soldiers who completed a tough 80 day training program. In this scenario we worked with a group of soldiers who lived in the same place, had the same daily diet. Plasma from their blood was analysed in this high-tech machine. Hundreds of small signature molecules called metabolites were identified. They're essentially intermediates that tell you how well um, your body is generating energy. We compare their physical fitness and health after exercise and we measure the metabolites before and after and look at the changes. Levels of a molecule called DMGV provided the red flag. Those recruits with higher levels of DMGV didn't reap the rewards of exercise. Several risk factors such as body fat, cholesterol or blood pressure didn't improve. If we know who won't benefit from exercise, it would mean that those people would need other support for cardiovascular prevention over and above exercise. It's a step forward in helping those who are working hard to improve their health, but more than half of Australian adults are not doing enough exercise. Besides the physical benefits, it's also got some non-physical benefits like um, mental health. Gabriella Rogers, Nine News.